and I welcome you back to the Debrinic Channel. Tonight we are talking about Lake Oroville, we're going to be talking about Lake Shasta, Lake Trinity, and Lake Folsom as well. We're going to look at the snowpack, we're going to look at the weather forecast, there's plenty to talk about, and let's get right to it. We're going to start off at Lake Oroville, and the water level at Lake Oroville is currently 776.23 feet. This was taken Wednesday, May 4th, 2022. The level is 123 feet below full pool. Changes since yesterday, this thing has slowed down on the rise, but it's still rising slowly. 0 0.07 feet. Your inflows are 4,557. Your outflows are 3,275. 50 5% of capacity and your current storage volume is 1,933,389 acre feet. Lake Oroville's current water temperature 65 degrees. Today's forecast is clear throughout the day with a high around 83 to low around 63. Winds are out of the southeast at 5 miles per hour with gusts of 12 miles per hour and your current temperature is 81 degrees there at Lake Oroville. Now we're going out to Trinity water level. The water level at Trinity Lake is currently 2,225.80 feet, and this was taken Wednesday, May 4th, 2022. The level is currently 144.20 feet below the top of the glory hole. The glory hole is 2,370 feet, and changes since yesterday, 0 0.17 feet. The storage acre feet is currently 762,930. 39 acre feet. Your inflows are currently 1,287. Your outflows are 1,840. 31% of capacity is what's going on there. And we go to the temperature. Trinity Lake's current water temperature is 59 degrees. Today's forecast is clear throughout the day with a high around 82 and a low around 50. Winds are out of the southwest at 4 miles per hour with gusts up to 12. And your current air temperatures sunny and 81 degrees in California and now we are going over to Lake Shasta And Lake Shasta's current water level is 946.05 feet MSL. Wednesday, May 4th, 2022. The level is 120.95 feet below full pool of 1,067. This thing's on the increase 0 0.09 feet. And we go to Shasta's storage acre feet. And that's 1,810,623. Your percentage of capacity, this thing's actually made it to 40 finally. And your inflows are 3,370 CFS. Your outflows are 2,663 CFS. And we go to Lake Shasta's water temperature and forecast for today. Shasta's current water temperature is 64 degrees. Today's forecast is clear throughout the day with a high around 85 and a low around 57. Winds are out of the north-northwest at 5 miles per hour with gusts up to 13 miles per hour. It's sunny and the air temperature is currently. 84 degrees and we go over to Lake Folsom next Lake Folsom's water level is currently 448.65 feet MSL. Wednesday, May 4th, 2022. The level is 17.35 feet below full pool of 466. And your changes since yesterday, this thing's really been on the increase. 0 0.55 feet. And we go check your inflows versus your outflows. Your current inflows are currently 4,226. Your outflows are 1,240. 
44, 81%. This thing was at 80 the other day, so it has rose one more percent. Your storage acre feet is currently 786,809 feet. And we go over to the water temperature at Folsom. Lake Folsom's current water temperature, 62 degrees. Today's forecast is clear throughout the day with a high around 86 and a low around 54. Winds out of the south-southeast at 4 miles per hour with gusts of 11 miles per hour. Sunny, beautiful day there in California throughout every lake. 84 degrees, light winds. And that is what's going on there. One of my viewers asked me for the update on the U.S. drought. And we will go do that now. Here is California. You can see that California itself is still in extreme drought here. And you also have severe drought on the east side of California and the west side with extreme drought right in the middle, right along the river system here in the Sierra Mountain Range here. And then down here by Sandy. Diego, not so much up here in northern part of California. It's moderate drought, and I do have a little bit of good news. We'll check the snowpack first, and then we go to windy.com after that. Here's your snow water equivalent for April 1st. This is 19%. Today it's 29%, so it's a little bit higher. You could tell the central still pretty got a pretty decent snowpack 25%, 33% for today, 11%, and 15% for the southern Sierra. This thing almost depleted it keeps dwindling it hides around 80 it, does, it won't take very long and this is department of water resources california data exchange center and i appreciate them letting me use this let's go over to windy.com and see what it, the current weather forecast is for california as we roll over to windy.com we are here in california the next 12 hours you have no precipitation we go to the three days and you get a little precipitation especially Especially over here by Lake Oroville, 0.41 inches. So that's a decent amount. Let's see if this is new snow and just a little bit up here, but not nothing crazy. They're talking one inch there. We go back to the rain accumulation. We go to the next five and you get a good solid one inch, 1.4 new snow, seven inches. So, I mean, there is still some snow here in the mountains possibly coming. And we scoot up here to Shasta up here, 4.5 Mount Shasta. 66 here's lake shasta here go over here by trinity 10.7 so this is good news we go back to the rain accumulation and you can see that they're going to get 1.42 in between mount shasta seven tenths of an inch and we go the next 10 days and this thing lights up especially down here by lake oroville 1.35 and we come up here to mount shasta 1.54 so this is good especially over here by trinity 1.1 and look at all this over here crescent city over here they're gonna get hammered 3.51 and then along the coast here 5.13 that will help when we scoot down a little bit closer here all the way down by mammoth lakes here they're gonna get 0.49 south lake tahoe almost one inch so this system comes all the way down not quite to bakersfield down here you're getting potterville down here is four tenths of an inch big pine over here 3.1 and bishop three tenths of an inch so that's what's going on in the next 10 days and that is all i have for tonight thank you guys for stopping by hope you enjoy the new graphs and we will see you on the next one god bless